High budget, low budget, comedy, drama, documentary, you can find just about every kind of movie at the Black Harvest Film Festival. This event showcases the work of black artists from around the world, but there's one film that hits kind of close to home. Derek Grace's On the Front Line explores the violence on Chicago streets with activists, former gangbangers, all trying to diagnose this problem. Just take a look. If you don't get involved, then that means that you're going to allow uh, the gangs to control the community, the neighborhood, the businesses, and moreover, when you don't snitch, that means that your mind is being controlled. And here now is writer-director Derek Grace and Sergio Mims, who's with the Black Harvest Film Festival. So Derek, let me start with you. Why did you want to uh, make this film? Well, I want to make this film uh, originally because I have a friend, his name is Ronald Holton, and I've been known him for about mm -hmm. 20 years, and his son got shot on the uh, bus in 2007. And I approached Ronald and asked, because we'd done projects together, and said, uh, why don't we do a documentary? And I think everything was a little too close to his heart at the time, but it kind of affected me too to see what happened to his son and how he was reacting. So I figured that one way for me to deal with this uh, gun violence situation is for me to use what I have, and that's the camera and, and the ability to uh, put together a story. And what message do you hope to get out? What do you hope people take away? Well, I hope that they take away that regardless of who you are, there's something that you can do. And, and one of the messages I have is that if we all do a little, a lot can be done. So I just want people to uh, be able to participate with some of the organizations that I actually interviewed and volunteer because they need resources, be it money, be it bodies, volunteers. So that's the message is that when they're done, I want to pick up the phone and call one of these organizations and, and do my part to help stop this gun violence in Chicago. All right. Now, Sergio, you, you guys have, at the Black Har Harvest Film Festival, have been a fantastic conduit for some of these filmmakers. How's the response this year? The response has been absolutely great. Uh, we continue until September 2nd. Mm -hmm. This is our 16th year. Derek's film is a perfect example of what we try to do with the festival. We show all types of films. Films that deal with current issues, comedies, dramas, documentaries, as the um, Derek's film on the front line and the uh, Basquiat film mm -hmm. that we showed. Uh, Closing Night film is a new film called Night Catches Us with Anthony Mackey mm -hmm. and Kerry Washington, mm -hmm. which is coming out in early December, but we have a preview of that film. Most of the films, the filmmakers are there, and we always have a Q&A afterwards. We show over 40 films in the festival. And the Q&As after the festival can be very intense. I bet. And quite interesting, and they could go on forever if I'm not there <laughs> to stop them. Absolutely. But um, it's almost an interactive film festival. And I said, this is our 16th year. You know, we open up this year, um, Common was our honoree. Excellent. Which was um, huge you know, get for us. Absolutely. And as Derek was telling me off camera, now we're going to have to top ourselves next year. That's true. That's true. You've done a great job year after year, uh, Sarah Jo. So thank you so much for bringing us the Black Harvest Film Festival. And Derek, good luck with your documentary. Obviously, it's very poignant and very critical at this time. It's a big problem here in Chicago, so hopefully it'll help make a difference. And if you want more information about the Black Harvest Film Festival, you can log on to our website, NBCChicago.com, and search Black Harvest. To learn more about Derek's film, On the Front Line, head to OnTheFrontLineMovie.com. Thanks again, guys, for coming in.